Good morning, my friends. Welcome to our blending lesson today. Today is Friday, November 6th. We're working in Unit 2, Week 3. It's the last day of the week. And this week we're working on those ending blends where we're going to take two consonants and we blend them together to make one sound. So let's do our high frequency words first. Make sure you're participating. Make sure you're paying attention to really help you own the words. There. Help. Again. New. Use. Could. Then. Live. One. Three. Under. Of. No. Who. Eat. All. Want. Call. Her. Day. Place. By. Many. Around. And walk. Thank you. All right, let's do our first word. Sweat. Your turn. Sw. Eh. Sweat. All right, so this was one of those short E words from last week, a couple weeks ago. SW, 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 we blend those together, sw. Remember, EA can now say eh, the short E, eh, sw, eh. Sweat. And T says T. Swa. E. T. Sweat. Right. So, um, this is like I'm. I broke. A, I broke a sweat yesterday because it was so hot. But or right now because it's so hot. If I'm saying that I did this yesterday, I sweated yesterday. Say. Sweated. All right. Next word. Buzz. Your turn. B. Uh. Z. Buzz. B says B. Sure, you like last week. Uh. Uh. B. Uh. B. Two Z's, we just double up on that Z. B, uh, buzz. Um, so if I want to make the word buzzed, what do I need? I need ED. That's like the, the fly buzzed in my ear. You can still blend it. B, uh, Z, D, buzzed. Stuff, your turn. Stuff, uh, f stuff. We got beginning blend stuff, 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 and our elbow sound uh, stuff, uh, stuff, and our wrist sound double up on the f, f stuff, uh. F Stuff. This is like I'm going to stuff my bag real tight. Um, but if I want to say that I did that yesterday in the past, I have to add an ed to make the word stuffed. Stuff. Uffed. Uh, stuffed. All right, let's go ahead and read our line. Sorry, it's a little close over here. Sweated. Buzzed. Stuffed. Your turn. Next word, it's your turn. It, it's. So this is one of those contractions that we talk about. I says it. T says ta. It, it. It's, it's, but if we have a contraction, we have to have an apostrophe. So remember, it's is the same as it, 
is. And the apostrophe replaces the letter that was taken away. So let's write that down here. So the word it's is it is we take away the I and we put an apostrophe in its place. Tent, your turn. Ta, eh, nt, tent. T says ta. E says eh, ta, eh, te. And our wrist sound, nt, nt, ta, nt, tent. Next word. Must. Your turn. M. Mm. A. Uh, st. Must. M says M. Mm. U says A. Uh, M. Mm, A. Uh, ma. S. T. St. Because S will say S and T will say T. S. Ta, sta, m, ust, must. Our next word. Trust. Your turn. Tur, a, uh, sta, trust. And I notice that when I say trust and must, I hear that same ending sound, ust, us. So t, r, ta, er, we blend those together. Tur. And U says a, uh, tur, a, uh, tra. S T st, tur, ust, uh, trust. Next word. Crisp. Your turn. Cur, i, sp, crisp. Cr cur ka er cur. I says i cur i curi. Sp sp cur i sp crisp. Next word. Trunk. Your turn. Tur a. Uh, Unk, trunk. So this has a beginning blend. T R T R T R, and it also has an ending blend. U says a uh, T R A uh, T R A. N K N K N T R A N K. Trunk. Next word. Clump. Your turn. Col. A. Mp. Clump. C L. Col. K O. Put those together. Col. U says a. Uh, col. A. Uh, cla. And our ending. Blend M P M P M P Pull a M P Clump. And last word. Stomp. Your turn. St. A. Ah. M P Stomp. So again, we have a beginning blend. S T St. St. O says ah, sta, ah, sta. Getting close to the edge here. Sorry. M P, mp, 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 sta, um, p, stomp, stomped your feet. All right, let's do our sentence. I 
high frequency word the T H E says what? The do the beginning blend S K SK because S will say S and K will say K S K SK. U says a uh, ska, a uh, ska. And K, nk, nk, ska, unk, skunk. High frequency word is. I think in is also a high frequency word, but we could sound this one out. I, n, in. High frequency word, the. T says ta. E says e, ta, e, te. And T, nt, nt, ta, e, nt, tent. All right, let's read our sentence. The skunk is in the tent. Your turn. Beautiful. So we need punctuation. At the end of this sentence, there are two types of punctuation we could have. We could have a period. And then it's just telling us something. It's telling us the skunk is in the tent. Or we could have an exclamation point. Personally, I would probably have an exclamation point if I were saying this. The skunk is in the tent. Oh my goodness, watch out, because that skunk is in our tent, and he might make it super duper stinky. So I am going to put an exclamation point here, and we need nouns. What are our nouns? Skunk is a noun. It's a thing. Okay. Like we talked about, an animal is kind of a thing because it's breathing. I would not want to touch a skunk, though. And tent is also a noun that it or it's kind of a place like if you're going to the tent going into the tent it's a place you're gonna go but it's also a thing because you could touch it um so let's read our whole board sweated buzzed stuffed your turn it's tent must trust your turn Crisp, trunk, clump, stomp. Your turn. And our sentence. The skunk is in the tent. Your turn. All right, wonderful. I'm looking for somebody brave who wants to read our whole blending board. Thanks so much for your focus and participation, guys.